Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 3, and today we're going to be talking about the finale, and it's got a title, and we've got some new scoops as to what's going to be happening in the finale. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any Supergirl videos later this year. So obviously the finale is going to be episode 23, so it's going to be an extended one episode from the past two seasons, so this episode is now officially titled battles lost and won so that sparks a lot of theories so it's obviously referring to battles lost and also separately battles won so from the title i can infer that there is going to be a winning battle during this episode and that will most likely be defeating rain but also there's going to be battles lost so there's going to be consequences of what happens when she's perhaps beaten and also i think the battles lost part is actually the idea that they actually couldn't save big spoilers, purity and pestilence, they actually do end up dying, but we don't know how as of now, but I think that's a reference to Battles Lost. And then maybe they will save Rain, maybe by splitting them as they've been intending to do. Hopefully that happens, but it hasn't been confirmed as of now. And so I think it's mainly just due to what's going to be happening in this episode, and maybe what happened the episode before in the penultimate episode, or the episodes leading up to it. So there is going to be Battles Won, there's going to be Battles Lost, and so I think it's a good finale title, and apparently it's subject to change like all titles. They changed a few titles earlier in the season, so obviously I I will keep a lookout in case they actually do end up changing it considering that it is such a big thing the title for the finale it's the most important episode of the entire season so anyway moving on to the scoop so tv line actually spoke to one of the executive producers and jessica actually gave us an idea of what's going to be happening and so they talk about kara and monel's relationship so this is what they said so it's one of those heartbreaking sort of star-crossed love stories where i don't know what to give away but we are really excited to have an opportunity to dig deeper into their connection and excavate what's under the surface. We want to make sure that those characters are honest with how they feel with each other without having to keep any barriers. So obviously she's trying not to give away a lot but as we know they're going to actually work past this awkwardness that has been introduced in this season since Monau has been back so after episode 15 we'll be fine and so Monau actually unburdens himself in episode 15 and I think this is definitely what Jessica's actually inferring to and so they are actually going to be becoming more transparent to each other and they're going to be talking a lot more and it's not going to be awkward so they're going to be having proper talks and she says their love story caramel's love story at the end of the season is going to be heartbreaking but it's one of those star cross stories so that introduces ideas of you know happiness and also of heartbreak so it's basically going to be a really mixed love story so we don't know exactly how it's going to end up happening it's either they're going to get back together or they're not i think it's as simple as that and so the most interesting part of the interview was when jessica said monel is going to be a big part of the show through the finale it's a heart-wrenching situation there's a lot of romance and a lot of drama and i would definitely tune in to see how that will play out so this is big news so the way that she puts it is that monel is going to be a very very crucial part of the finale episode in taking down rain and you know the ending and everything to do with the episode so she says through the finale which is an american way of saying throughout the whole episode we don't really say that in england so just to clarify to people who aren't american so through the finale she's saying that he's going to be a big part throughout the whole episode and so that means he's of great relevance in actually stopping rain and also the ending of the episode and how they're going to resolve the season three storyline and move on to season four and so she says there's a lot of romance and a lot of drama and it's a heart-wrenching situation and so from that you can infer that maybe they will get back together but there's going to be something really heart-wrenching with how the finale actually ends off season three and i'm guessing there's going to be little you know teasers of them getting back together or them actually breaking up i think if they're never going to get back together I think they will say in the finale or they will definitely hint at it that they aren't but you know I feel like they will definitely get back together sometime next season I would hazard the guess but considering that the executive producer actually thinks a lot about the Monel and Kara storyline I think it's of relevance as they are definitely thinking about it so I don't see why it shouldn't come back sometime in the future and I have no problem with them actually dragging it along but as long as it's not such a drag like the Elicity storyline so anyway guys so we've got a lot to look forward to in this finale we know that there's going to be a massive fight with rain 
they're going to end off the season. There's obviously going to be a cliffhanger, and this finale doesn't air until June, so we've got quite a while. We've got no breaks. Supergirl returns Monday night at 8, 7 central. We're going to be doing my review on Tuesday afternoon, so don't worry. I'll be covering all the Supergirl news as we get to that finale, so please be sure to subscribe if you are new, and also please be sure to leave a like and a comment on your opinions on this new news as to the finale, and what do you think about the title, Battles Lost and Won? But anyway guys, I will see you guys later, goodbye.